The latest study looking into how kids can spread COVID-19 is out with some startling findings. Researchers say they found more on the virus inside the nose and lungs of asymptomatic children than severely ill patients in the hospital. As 10 Tampa Bay's Bo Zimmer explains, that could mean they are also more likely to pass on the disease to classmates, to their teachers, and then they come home. It's the most comprehensive study to date. Researchers from Harvard University and Massachusetts General Hospital looking specifically at young people under the age of 22 measuring the amount of COVID-19 virus in their bodies. Younger kids do have the virus and maybe even in great number and thus they may have the ability to transmit it just as well. The study of nearly 200 young people compared the children and teens in many cases showing no symptoms to very sick adults in the hospital. And what researchers found was surprising. The issue of viral load in children being high when they're asymptomatic is very important. And I think this, if anything, should convince people that everyone needs to be wearing masks because you just never know. The results mirror a previous study in the journal Pediatrics from the American Medical Association, which reported when compared with adults, young children infected with COVID-19 had between 10 and 100 times more virus in their nose and throat, leaving some doctors to conclude children could potentially initiate super spreader events in reopened schools. Even for mild symptoms, you know, even for a little bit of cough, a little bit of runny nose, maybe things that parents wouldn't normally keep their children out of school for. We're really asking to keep them out this time and get them tested. They can act as hosts. Dr. Jay Wolfson is with USF Health. We spoke with him after the first study came out earlier this month. That creates a challenging issue as we move into the school year to ensure that they are protected, that the teachers and the staff of the school are protected from each other, and that the parents are protected when they go back home.